welcome back to mini vlog hi guys welcome back to mini vlogs for Isabella video I'm so sorry I feel so bad for my daughter yesterday she made 47 uh, long 47 minutes long video uh, studying her Amelia Videlia book but turns out she never opened the mic <laughs> so it's all mute so I feel so bad for her she worked so hard for that video and she was very sad this morning so I told her you know what I'm gonna go for a walk and I'm gonna you know show a little bit neighborhood stuff and I will upload for you and she was happy <laughs> forgive me I'm not a professional you know about for this old stuff usually my husband helps my daughter uh, let me tell you something about my neighborhood my neighborhood is extremely extremely uh, gorgeous and very private coming here is like it'll take like a 10 15 minutes you know we have a private uh, gate uh, everything's super nice here very nice you know you uh, barely see any thief I mean I'm not gonna lie there's a few people caught in a camera who came and then you know <sighs> please make sure your car is locked so so yep this is my neighborhood and I'm walking right now it's in the morning and shout out uh, I have a brother in Nepal his name is Binod Dakal and I'm pretty sure you guys know him he's a singer he's a fabulous singer and he's right now in Australia for programming and he hosting music festival in Nepal and he is amazing please support him you know uh, I'm gonna link below his channel and subscribe his channel <laughs> channel look at that Victorian house I love it when I'm gonna retire I'm gonna make this kind of house uh, right now we have a four bedroom house I still love my house oh my house is perfect <sighs> what else I'm sorry <laughs> again I'm not a professional person I don't know how to say and how to talk and what else oh yeah um, in my mom country, uh, we I bought two houses in a, within a five years, I think. The first house we bought in a, a little down from the Pokhara, and that is a one-story house, five bedroom, one uh, kitchen. And oh my God, that house is amazing. It built like a Jacqueline state, like America style. It's super pretty, but no one lives there right now. And the second house, after lockdown, I bought it in Kathmandu. Uh, it was a nice right how many bedrooms in there nine nine bedroom downstairs upstairs when we bought that house it was only one story house but it was a 10 bedroom and then but like I said it was an earthquake you know it wasn't like a good titty tidy holy crap in Nepal the land in houses is more expensive than here in state, super, super expensive. All my saving gone, Shiba. So yeah, uh, and uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say. Uh, what else? Yeah, so house is very expensive down there. Super, super, super expensive. Very expensive. And you gotta be very careful who you hiring, you know, like uh, agents, like here we have a real estate agent in the Nepal, there's all kinds of agents. And after I bought a house, I found out my agent took a lot of money from me. I didn't know that. Here, you know, like uh, when you have a closing, the closing cost, half of it goes to uh, uh, real estate people, but over there, no, 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 no. There's so many, like so many stuff. So you gotta be very careful. Uh, and I'm sorry, <laughs> I don't have a good voice. Uh, I have a cold. Uh, so let me tell you, um, I had my mom who lives in Kathmandu and she is 70, early 70s. And Armand, my brother lives down there too. He's amazing and he's a singer. He sings good stuff, but 
lately we're not talking, he blocked me because all he wants is money, 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 money. He doesn't understand how hard I work. And for me, you know, I don't mind how hard I work. I would love to save money, but at the same time, my husband tells me, you know, let him be. Like, I can't do that every time. He has to grow his own stuff. I have for you listening, this Roman. I do love you, but of my heart, and I'll be there for you no matter what. I promise I'll be there for you. You just have to say it, hey, I need this mom and I'll do it for you. But guess what? You just take advantage of me all the time. All the time you take advantage of me. You get mad when I don't send you money. You get mad when I don't, you, like I, if I don't buy you what you want, you get really mad and you blocked me. One time, two times, three times, okay. But the fourth time, you know, you cannot do keep doing this to me. And it hurts my feelings a lot, actually a lot. So please don't do that. I love you very much and I'll be there for you. You know, there's a few people and only handful people say this to you. Like, not just you, everybody in your life, anybody who listening to this, who watching this, you know, anybody, if someone in your life said, you know, like, you know, who means it, like, who's there for you, do whatever you, you're the luckiest person in the world because there's a no one, no one going to be there for you besides yourself, you know, even your own parents, no, no one's going to be there for you. So please, whenever... When you have that kind of person in your life, don't kick out. You're an unlucky person if you do that. Because in our time, there's no one. We have to work through it. I work so hard, so hard. I can't even tell you. No, not physically I work, but mentally, you know, like studying wise, everything is still. I should not just come here and talk like this. But guess what? I'm supporting my daughter. And I love her bottom of my heart. She's amazing. She's a great, great daughter. She studies so hard. She takes care of herself really good. She loves her brother. By the way, my son is just turned five and he's autistic. Oh my God, sometimes it's so good, sometimes it's so bad. So I'm going through that too, you know? But guess what? He taught me a patience, so much patience. You guys have no idea. He's the best thing I ever had. I love him so much, my goodness, it hurts my heart. And guess what? Work, guys, I'm not lying to you. You know, sleep minimum at least five hours and work hard. Because guess what? If you don't work hard, there's no one's gonna be behind you. Hey, do it, I'll do it for you. No one's gonna give you. You have to snatch it or you have to do it yourself. Especially if you're in, you know, early 20s or early 30s, this is the time you guys have to do it all by yourself. Don't waste your time to finding a you know, person who lovey-dovey. Oh, fun, lovey-dovey, everything is fun. But guess what, you're wasting your damn time. If you wanna make your career, if you wanna make your life better, focus on a book, focus on study. You know, be a, hang out with the smart people. You don't have to make a lot of flower friends. Make like a few who pull you up, who make you, you know, better. Who tells you if you do something bad? Who tells you, hey, you're doing this wrong way, do this way? That kind of person. Your life will be so amazing. Right now I'm studying. Oh my gosh. Last night I got so tired I couldn't even open my eye. But if I don't know, my husband doing PhD, he helps me sometimes, not all the time. He helps me around too. And I'm glad and I'm very, very thankful for that he's amazing I don't know <laughs> when you're doing the vlogs which you, you talk I'm just telling you my life blah 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 oh gosh we have a nice house I'll come 
and there's a lot of leaves and the ground. My husband cut the grass yesterday. Our houses look so pretty and tidy tidy. My in-laws coming soon. We're going DC, Washington DC this week, end of this week I think, for a week. My husband every year he does the marathon. So DC marathon will be fun. Man, I used to run so good. After my bite, I don't know what happened. I can't even run. My legs, my knees, my calf hurts so bad. Oh, look at this house. How amazing this is. Super amazing. Loved it. Oh, this house had a dog. So somebody cleaning the hire this company is good. <laughs> Try stay today. So when I was young, I want to be a singer. <laughs> I'm going to tell you this. When I was young, I want to be a singer so bad because my grandma has such a beautiful voice. My mom has such a beautiful voice. And I used to mumble. Uh, I used to say, sing like. <laughs> and one time, my mom came and she told me, you can't sing. Your voice is like a very scratchy and like a man. God, that time, my confidence level went whoop all the way down. And after that, I never sang. But when Armand told me he want to be a singer, oh my gosh, I was so happy. And I asked him, are you 100% sure you want to be a singer? And he goes, yes. And he used to sing also when he was in boarding school, you know. So I said, okay, I'll support you if, if you're good at it. I'll support you and I have a few cousins and I have a not few I have a little bit people friends and I contact my brother his name is Sonam and he's a director producer and he's a also I think he's a host in a country for uh, channel and he's amazing guys if you want to make your video next level he is amazing. Contact him. He's amazing. So I contact him and then he pretty much in a police. Erman. Oh, not that, not just him. Uh, we know also. We know did it too, you know. And funny thing is, like, uh, I love both of them. So now, if you're listening, I love you uh, as a brother. <laughs> you're like, you're a brother, you know your last name and our last name is your brother and then uh we know i love you also i thank you for everything what you did for Arman. you know what you're doing for Arman, and i really really appreciate it but somehow Arman, uh he respects sunam a lot but he talk talks a lot about we he keeps saying uh, we know that this, we know that did this, that. I think he is a little bit closer to we know than Sonam. Sonam, he respect other, you know, own family like that. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, they just finished this house. I love this house. So sad. If you have money, within six months, your house will be done. Like that. This house, literally, not even six months, will finish. I don't think so people move here. So yes, and he is amazing. And I'm 90s girl. I love 90s romantic song. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Makes me so much better fly. So I'm saving a little bit more money. <laughs> uh, I want uh, so now I'm and then we know the work for like some album. I want at least two romantic songs. And our I don't know, it's gonna be success or not because I have a few plans for Armand in the state but that's the thing he doesn't want to come to the state at all I don't know why people dream for you know coming to the America but he don't want to come America at all he wants to go to the Korea 
who wants to just study there, he wants to do a bunch of other stuff, I don't know. Maybe he's too young for that. <sighs> yeah, so that is, um, what else should I talk? <sighs> I cannot talk about my work. I mean, I can, but I'm not gonna do that. My work is not a piece of cake. It's hard. <sighs> yes, super hard. Let me say this. Uh, sometime, you know, uh, that's my personal theory. Not, you know, there's no shines. When you find, not find, I mean, when someone loves you, you know, who cares about you generally, I feel like don't look for that person to have a money or not. You know, if that person generally loves you, cares about you, just go through it sometimes you know you push each other up and you do better up but at the same time don't forget your own family like mother sister brother right if they take advantage of you you know what don't even bother but if they don't take advantage of you please watch them because you know when you're a baby they did the same thing to you they take care of you, they you know, feed you, they work very hard for you, like that. I take care of my mom a lot, even though she didn't, she didn't take care of me. I'm gonna say this loud out. She did not take care of me at all. But guess what? I'm not gonna be that kind of person who doesn't, you know, take care of you, who didn't do nothing for you. That's not my personality at all. Oh my gosh, almost there. So this is my favorite place. There's a small lake down here. I usually come here when I'm very low and down. Usually people fish, you know, catch fish here. Oh gosh. So it's very beautiful down here, it's super pretty. I had a friend, she used to live down here. Her husband is a pilot, and their house, their house is amazing too. But she moved away in Florida, Miami, because her husband got a new job. I miss you. Hey, Elizabeth, if you're listening to this, I miss you, girl. Oh, this is so peaceful. Look at that. My daughter is very, very new in a, uh, this, uh, what you call, YouTube, you know, she doesn't know, she's only nine, just turned nine years old, and she wants to be a YouTuber, I don't know, like, you know, is a good idea or bad idea, but she's very uh, confident on herself, she loves being uh, on camera, she wants to be, work with Disney, I don't know, it's gonna happen but she wants to do that let's see if her dream comes true i'll be there for her if she needs anything you know oh goodness that's so pretty look at that my husband loves fishing Have my mic working right now because <laughs> yesterday when my daughter did this her mic wasn't working at all oh, super nice after this I have to go work out man I haven't gone work out four days because my son and my daughter was sick this cold even we have a Flu shot is still, you know, just driving me nuts. I'm a guinea pig. I don't know why. I feel like uh, if you have a flu shot, any shot, any shot, God swear. Maybe I'm working in a medical field or what, right? Most of my friends doesn't get shots at all. 
but me mm -mm. any shot give it to me i feel like uh, you know what there's so many scientists behind that right they should be they they should know what they're doing so the other hand my husband does not believe at all at all he'll do it when absolutely needed otherwise mm -mm. he doesn't do nothing it's a beautiful morning enjoy guys i know my camera is so much moving i'm so sorry but this is a beautiful moment and enjoy as much as you can <laughs> do you know her funny thing <laughs> last week uh, we went to the camping uh, me my husband my daughter and my son and you know we were walking by the creek and I asked my husband hey honey what do you think my voice can I be a singer he could he laughed so hard and he could I don't know your country voice but in America you do have a good voice <laughs> <laughs> and my daughter goes, no, 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 don't be a singer. It's okay, mama. You can sing in the house. Not, you know, like be a singer, singer. money doesn't buy happiness <laughs> if you have money you have everything but you have to work hard not just work hard smartly oh, someone owns a boat shout out to my in-laws they just bought boat too I have fish here a lot. <gasps> Look at that fish! You guys see that? Oh my gosh, that fish here. A lot of them. Oh, that's a dirty boat. A lot. I'm sorry guys. It's not that good looking at all. It's so much sunny. Face down there. Lots of fish. It's dirty right now. Water. Look at that. Oh my gosh! So much fish there. Oopsie dizzy. <clears throat> oh, let me sit here. guys my face but <laughs> I don't feel comfortable oh goodness oh I can see so many fish <gasps> oh my gosh and what I'm saying I'm just filming me that <laughs> oh gosh gotta go home I'm thirsty very much actually Jesus that 
goose is loud. You heard that? The goose is so loud. Little puppy, fly, fly, fly. So that was over there, that deck, my friend deck, see Soul House, I think five months ago now. You know, I have a drone, two drone, I bought it. And guess what? I haven't used one. I was thinking about going back home, my mom country, and then give it to a few of them to my brother, but I didn't have a chance. I would go this year, but yeah, always family drama, so I don't want to waste my money and energy where I can not be happy, so I changed my mind. So there is a girl in her mom college, one of them, I think his tuition teacher, I forgot her name. Sweetheart, if you're listening to this, I don't know how and when, what happened. I cannot text you, I, not, I can't do anything. I cannot find your account, anything, sweetie. Uh, if you feel free ask uh, Armand my phone number and you can text me okay I love to talk to you and like I said I'm not lying if you need something I'll be there for you and good morning uh, work hard study good sooner or later you'll be very successful uh, work on yourself don't be a you know I know you're young but still work on yourself sweetheart don't think you know I don't have a parents I know I'm not your real blood and I mean it I'll be there for you if you need something I can't I'll be there physically but if I can help you I'll be there for you in I promise you're not the one uh, alone. There's so many children alone in that, not just that country, everywhere. So, good morning. So, that is, like I said, I cannot contact you. Sounds like. I don't know, looks like you blocked me or something. But I do miss you talking, okay? You're an amazing person. Be like that, don't change for anyone. Oopsie dizzy. Oops, fell down. This road, this path, up and down and up and down and up and down so much. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. This
this video for everyone not just for kids please YouTube don't put as a just kid this video for everyone please <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that jackass, driving so fast, it's only 50 miles per hour, and you're driving at least 50. So, who watching this, white truck, Ford, same on you, you ran over my dog and you didn't even stop. And my London passed away right away. Same on you. That's where if I see you, you know, I try, but my camera didn't catch, it was too fast. You're gonna go jail and shame on you. You hit and run my dog because you're driving damn fast also. You breathing. Take a one step at a time. What are you going through? You know, ask for help. I helped so much. Recently, I studied so especially like a young teenage going through so much especially mentally and so think about what other people are going through also if you're confused seek a help please guys the world is beautiful you think your world upside down guess what you just have a tons of hormones. Hormones makes you upside down, not your brain. So do the meditation at least 15 minutes a day. Eat healthy food. You know, if you feel sad or weak, go for a walk. Seriously, go for a walk. You don't need anybody. Just go for a walk think about what other people are going through especially look the different country video you know I show my daughter sometime Guatemala or Nepal not all don't take this wrong way you know or South Africa or different different country people are struggling you know they don't have even food they don't have water but they're living and they are thankful What's that kind of video, you know, makes you very much blessed, trust me, very, very much blessed what you have and what you're doing. And seriously, if you're over 18, ask family permission, you know, travel. Sometimes travel helps a lot. I used to travel all the time, not anymore because I have two kids now and I have a house responsibility, husband, kids, you know, dog, cat. Traveling helps a lot too. Meet new people. You don't have to make a lot of friends, but very careful. There's so many bad people out there who will take advantage of you, who will think when they see you, you're for foreigner. Oh, sorry, like, sorry, my English is not coming out. Uh, like, you know, American or, you know, other stuff, they'll take advantage of you. So please, careful. Not all people. Don't take the wrong way, please. Not all people, but some people are scamming you really bad. So please, you gotta watch out. Oh, I cannot 
tell you guys this braids get so damn good it's a slowly it's wind slowly coming oh, it's so super good fresh super fresh you know i love to <laughs> when i'm walking like this alone when i'm not filming like this i would like <laughs> Sing a little bit, but right now I'm too shy to sing. <laughs> oh gosh. I'm excited. My in law's coming. My mother in law coming. She's amazing. Oh, I'm excited to go to DC too. My husband keeps asking me to take a medicine because I have a sinus. It's Friday, I went to the doctor. And she told me I have sinuses going bad. So she prescribed me very high dose uh, pills I cannot take. She told me to take two times a day, but every time I take it dro make me so drowsy, make me so loopy I can't do anything. So I used to take a night time. Yesterday I took I think it's five o'clock and I was out, literally out. I did a couple of times and I couldn't do nothing and I'm not that kind of person to sit around home doing nothing when I'm home I clean house or I study but that medicine does not let me do nothing gosh I think it's a Friday I had the test and I took that medicine I was so damn sleepy oh goodness and yesterday I took medicine my daughter was making a YouTube video, but guess what? I didn't even pay attention to have her mic turn off. Good morning. Her mic was off, and I didn't know that she was sitting there and studying and you know, having fun. But guess what? Later on, we checked the video. There's no sound at all. So. Good morning. Festival coming soon. I think it was uh, October 24th. Is you you put the tikka on the forehead and you get lots of money. So I was thinking about buying a traditional kurta surba. Kurta surba, I think. Yeah, yeah kurta surba. I was thinking about. Uh, please, if you know like a good website, you know, uh, comment down below, please in some jewelry too i need to buy some traditional clothes for my daughter my son my husband usually don't wear he feel uncomfortable but if i ask him he will do it he's such an amazing person goodness i'm so lucky to have him <laughs> oh gosh he's such a smart man smart kind and very much chantali do you know chantali means <laughs> oh he does not like to share his money at all or give and he does not trust people at all me if someone says something i feel like uh, they're telling the whole truth but my husband uh-uh don't even think about it he uh he did his bachelor in a business management a master in uh master what is it project manager signed something i don't even remember and right now he's doing his PhD. Oh my God, my husband is extremely, extremely smart man. You know, funny thing is, when me and my husband met, it, uh, met we were such a good friends. We we didn't go on a date, lovey-dovey, it wasn't lot like that. We were really good friends. And when I met my husband, <laughs> I had the bachelor degree already. My husband didn't even have a bachelor degree at all. I, I had it. I was the highest educated, but now my husband is the highest educated, and I'm proud of him. But at the same time, a little bit. <laughs> the 
the same time, I feel a little bit jealous because, you know, he's going so much better up, you know, and me, like, uh, I'm, I'm going to school right now. I started in September. I know I have a long way to go, but I'm glad. He teach me, if he knows stuff, you know, he teach me, he said, do this way, might be. But his way of studying and my way of studying is so much different. Like when I study, I study like page by page, you know, one by one. And it'll take me, but I'll be there. But my husband is so damn smart. He just go through and then he guesses and his guess, it's right. Goodness, and that blows my mind. I miss my best friend. Uh, I have a Maria. Hi Maria, if you're watching this, hi, I miss you. Hi Sebastian, Auntie miss you. Isabella, I miss you guys so much. And I miss my sister, Lupe. Hi honey, I know our parents is not the same, but you're like my baby sister. And Eva, I miss you so much. You guys are the amazing, amazing people I ever met. And I miss you so much. Can't wait to see you guys. I'm gonna pray for you guys. Do better, be a better. And I wish you guys became successful every, every step away. I love you guys. And Franco, I know you're getting bigger now you're older than William three years oh sorry three months older than William I hope you've been good with mommy I love you boy you're such a cute oh gosh almost home oh guess what there's huge oh, what's this called I forgot rosemary his grandpa recent big grandpa grandpa ran has a lot of cameras a lot of batteries a lot of new phones oh my gosh my husband's just like his grandpa did I tell you my father-in-law he's a pilot yay 
he has his license now. Now or already? I think he's already have it. I don't even know that. I think it's renewable. Good morning. Okay, this is my neighborhood. Let me show you guys. I'm not kidding, I'm so damn thirsty. Okay, this is, you cannot see. Well, because of. Slow down? Never. Never ever. Slow down. At Christmas time, this house looks so amazing. My goodness, more than mine. I love this house. Some people so into Christmas. Tammy, if you're watching, I love you and I miss you. She loves Halloween. In Halloween time, her house is the most amazing she's my best friend and sister we used to work together all the time oh gosh she's amazing okay almost there should i hold like this yep definitely you know <laughs> oh my gosh i feel like my action worse like uh, thicker and thicker I don't know why I don't feel comfortable at all when I speak English this is one of my friend's house her mother has cancer to the Georgia at this house so right here right there white truck ran into my dog I mean no can't even say the dog it was only five month old puppy and he didn't even stop luckily my neighbor came he hold it and brought in my porch Poor baby. I miss you, England. Love you. And London. Oh, beautiful this house also. Right? Oh god, nice. Okay, guess what? I'm almost there. My house is right there. different house a little bigger we're not gonna sell our home this house we're gonna rent it but I want a little bit house bigger at least five bedrooms or six bedrooms and I want a little bit of land I, at least like a three acre yeah we have a in mind what we're gonna do if we have a little bit more land we have a little bit land this is my house Ta-da! <laughs> Hello. Hi house. Okay, so this is my house. Thank you for watching my channel, my daughter channel. And see you later. I hope you like this video. Uh, like and thumbs up and subscribe please. Bye bye. Have a wonderful day.